I'm going through the Excel add-in for Time GPT. So the first thing I'm going to want to do is get that add-in set up within Excel. I'm on a Mac, so I can go to Insert, Add-ins, Get Add-ins. I am going to search for Time GPT. I will click Add. Then it pops up over here and I have this Get Started button. So I say get started um, and it needs my API key. And so I can get that by going to the time GPT dashboard, dashboard.nixlib.io in this API keys tab. And I'm going to copy my API key. Now I am going to come back over here, paste that in, hit this arrow and I am all set up. So I am going to do forecasting. So I'm going to click on this forecast button here. I'm using the air passengers data set. Um, so this is monthly data. So I will change the frequency to monthly. The seven horizon is fine. Um, now I need to tell it which are my dates and which are my values. So my dates are in this A column. Uh, I'm going to need to highlight uh, the entire set of dates here from the beginning to the end. There we go. Um, and then my values are in this B column. Um, I can just actually type here B2 to B145. And then I'm all set. I will click Make Prediction. And voila, here we go. Right within Excel, we have time GPT predictions for this air passenger data. We are good to go.